Welcome back, Nordies, to part two of our cybersecurity ABCs, where we introduce and explain key terms and concepts. Our term today is breach. Picture this, you're checking your email when you notice that it looks like you've been signed up to a lot of strange services and mailing lists. Many of these emails are from strange addresses and are trying to get you to follow suspicious links. It sounds like your email address may have been leaked in a data breach. I'm sure you've seen your fill of cybersecurity scandals over the past year. The most common of these are data breaches, where hackers will break into a supposedly secure server and make off with terabytes of incriminating information. Here's the kicker. Many breaches are down to shoddy and weak cybersecurity. Breaches can be separated into two categories, security and data. A security breach is when someone breaks into a computer system and accesses information. A data breach is where a hacker will break in and run off with potentially terabytes of data. What do you do if you've been the victim of a security breach? The first thing you need to establish is how your data could have been breached. Has your email address been leaked? It's time to revisit your passwords and reset them. If you suspect your financial details have been leaked, contact your bank as soon as possible. Once you've changed passwords and notified the right people, keep a close eye on all your online accounts in case of suspicious activity. And that's the basics of cybersecurity breaches. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the official NordVPN YouTube channel and press the bell icon so you can catch our next edition of Cybersecurity ABC.